Here they come, Wild Hog and none other than his partner. <laughs> waiting him right now. This match is a one ball minute time limit, assisted by Wall at 268, King Harley Hog. His opponent from the Caribbean at 241, Calypso Jim. to start off at a great pace. If it keep up like this, we're in for one exciting match, Dave. Calypso threatening to give him a punch, flirting with disqualification. This is a fast flying action match. The Hogs took their time into the ring. They didn't want to mix it up with a big Yukon. They have one of them right there in the aisle. I know one thing, there was a detour team place, and Moose was making a detour. They were the ones making the detour. Calypso over the King Harley Hog. Oh, what a drop kick. He told me he was going to do it. He told me he can do it. Calypso Jim. He said, David, I've been in my own gym out in the garage. I've had the big weight, 25 pound sand weight on each ankle. And I've been jumping, jumping, jumping. I've been listening to the music of Jeffrey Osborne, Patrice Rush, and Chaka Khan in the Zap Band, and I've just been loving every minute of it, exercising with those weights, and now you just saw it, Calypso Jim giving a demonstration of what all the training is about, high flying drop kick. King Harley Hall giving him a fast jolt to the throat, possibly now choking him if that chin is not holding his forearm back from the throat. George, it just takes the wind out of Calypso. Well, you know, I was watching Calypso earlier in the match. Like a lot of our wrestlers, like a lot of the wrestlers, Calypso has a tendency to ease up once he has his opponent going because he doesn't want to inflict capital punishment to him. And this is the problem with a lot of wrestlers that I talk to, and I tell them, I understand your feelings sometime, and you, you have the soft spot in your heart, but you can't afford to have it when you're wrestling the type of Harley Hogg or J.R. Hogg. There's no two ways about it. You're right, because they don't let up at all. Oh, a nice guy right there. The Harley Hogg pins him against the rope. From Johnny Shore. Johnny Shore, we're going to need a referee's decision here. In fact, Johnny, the foot was on the rope. Did you see it? I didn't see the foot on the rope, so he stole the match from him. That's all. 
Johnny Shorn declaring the winner of the match, King Harley Hogg, a disc justice, but the referee was blocked from seeing the action. No fault of Johnny Shorn, though. Fans 